We're going to spend three hours <laughs> in character creation. Okay, are we ready? I think we're ready. Catch a ball. Well, catch all of the, the cute ones. Oh, is that our bike? But look at him. Look at his face. It's like a cute little broccolini. She's way too nice. I'm skeptical of nice people. <laughs> Pokemon, gotta catch him all. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm excited. Let's get going. There's rainbow. <laughs> I love every time the rainbow comes across, I'm so happy. What language shall we play in? Japanese? I guess we'll play in English. <laughs> I guess we'll play in English. <sighs> Use the left stick. Okay. Am I, st is it just these faces? Am I stuck with the faces? I feel like this one is the closest. Also because I like the orange eyes. Can I customize? <gasps> what is my name? My name is Clea. Clea. I can change hairstyle. Chalk crop to me kind of looks like the layers are a bit janky. <laughs> to me, that's a little bit, you know, a little bit frazzled. Am I being generic if I choose the the braids? You both think pixie cut? I mean, it is cute. We're going to spend three hours <laughs> in character creation. Green. Oh, I'd like a funky hair color. Denim blue, light denim blue. <laughs> Our hair is a color of denim. <laughs> interesting you know i kind of like purple i don't i don't think the pixie cut is me i gotta say i appreciate your guys opinions but i kind of want to be a basic b <laughs> i kind of want to be a basic b and do this base buttons <laughs> i don't know maybe a lighter oh now that i see this smoky pink lavender what color do we think and then i'll completely ignore what color you guys suggest to <laughs> well the green isn't bad though Blue green, oh very bright. Brown, because I kind of like this. It steers me away from my usual purples and pinks. We can always change it later. I'm sure it'll cost us money, but we can always change it later. <laughs> Doesn't changing stuff uh, cost money in Pokemon games usually? I kind of like the green. I'm going with it. Also, I don't know what color the clothes are. Oh, maybe purple? Purple and green go together though. Uh, look, I'm guessing is just skin color, right? But we want to be the palest of pale because that's what we are. <laughs> that's what we are. Okay, are we ready? I think we're ready. I remember when I was a kid, I mean, this is partly to do with my, my face as well, but I got given SPF 80 prescription sunscreen to wear. <laughs> prescription sunscreen because I was that pale. Okay, I think we're ready. Am I just waking up? Enrollment application, Uva Academy. Enrollment complete. <gasps> We're going to school. I don't know much about this game, except that you're enrolled in a school. That's all I know. <laughs> That's all I know. Leading the way into the future while valuing our individuality. Is this an ad for the school? Who is that? Um, oh, I'm supposed to click. It's time for you two to dive into the world of Pokemon. How do I get a cool glove like that? Da da da! Exciting. Yeah, how do the NPCs have better hairstyles? <laughs> what the? I'm sure I can unlock stuff later, right? Director Clavel, head of Uber Academy. Paldea is a sprawling region bursting with lush nature and magnificent landscapes and a weird hole in the middle of it by the looks of it, <laughs> which I'm sure has nothing to do with legendary Pokemon. Maybe it doesn't. I don't know. It is also, of course, the home to the mysterious creatures known to us as Pokemon. They reside here in great numbers, in fact. Oh, he's got a lot of Pokeballs. <gasps> Poor Mott, we, we need one. <laughs> we need one. <laughs> Add this to the list. 
I want a poor mark. Pokemon can be found living all over. Oh, is it? Are we already encountering an issue or is this supposed to happen? Pokemon can be found living all over, in the seas, in the skies, even in our cities and small towns. Needed Pokemon count one. Maybe I should have one in the top corner because it's going to reach 800, I'm sure. <laughs> oh no, it's supposed to happen like this. Okay, I'm, I'm just so expecting there to be like technical issues in the game. I'm sure they've solved all of those because what, this game came out like over a year ago now. But I'm just expecting it, <laughs> you know, just in case. We humans coexist with Pokemon as we both help one another to live and thrive. Uber Academy is here to help you learn even more about these precious partners. Within our halls, people from all regions gather to study together. And as Pokemon trainers, they have their Pokemon do battle growing alongside them. At least it's not like um, Power World, you know. <laughs> Cutscenes in my Pokemon? How could they? I don't know what the story is in this, other than us going to school and taking classes. I'm hoping it's good. While our robust curriculum of course walk, <laughs> coursework helps our students draw forth their fullest potential. Oh, our teachers are cool. It is within these halls that you will find- Oh god, we the faculty and staff at Uber Academy can't wait to welcome you with open arms. It was allowing me to read everything before. <laughs> suddenly decided not to catch them all well catch all of the the cute ones you know and maybe a couple of necessity ones but for the most part just the cute ones would be best i think <laughs> well this is cool though i also think it's open world right Ooh. Eevee, that's you. Oh, is that our bike? <laughs> that's our bike, right? It's a Pokemon, but it's our bike. Kinda open world. Okay, kinda. Whoa. Lighthouse? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> that's not good. Okay. Oh, what are they? Also, I'm I'm totally, I'm mostly spoiler free in terms of like what Pokemon are in this game. I had a look at the list, but there's a lot of Pokemon that I don't know. So we're going to be discovering as we go. Pokemon dead one. <laughs> Thank you for keeping tallies on everything, DM. <laughs> we got some dead Pokemon. Oh, this is my room. Dead Pokemon, we got one Pokemon want. We're getting there. Oh, look at my cute stickers. Get up. Is this my outfit? Can I choose my outfit? <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. I don't know about these shorts. <laughs> I'm going to say. I know it's early game, but... I don't know about the shorts. I mean, they're utility shorts, right? They're, they've got faculty. They'll do stuff. That's a cute hat, though. <gasps> oh my god, I want one of these. Squovit? Is it the one? I want a Squovit pillow buddy thing. Oh. Ah! Wait, which one's which? Squovit or... I can't remember. This is what this whole thing is going to be. What Pokemon is that? <laughs> Hello? Oh no, I know. Muncha! Is that our mum's? Wow! Look at this kitchen! I want a kitchen like this. I'm taking design tips from uh, from Pokemon. <laughs> Good morning, Clea! Oh, she's my mom. She's an American. Oh, already in your uniform and everything. Well, it is your first day at your new school, after all. She's so cute. Our mum is super cute. <laughs> I'm so excited for you. Still, you might want to cool your engines before you go racing out the door. The school contacted me and said that you're supposed to wait here a little while longer. Their words, not mine. Apparently there's something very important for your first day that still hasn't arrived. Okay. Ding dong. Is it the bicycle Pokemon? 
<laughs> before you go to school, don't. <laughs> yeah. Maybe that's the very thing we're waiting for. Clear, get to the door, would you? Okay. But first, can I explore a little more? Oh, look, there's a little pet bed and toys. <gasps> look at the Tita. Hello. Oh, do forgive the intrusion. Is that the principal? You are Miss Clear, yes? On behalf of the Academy, I must apologise for the late arrival of your enrolment documents. Ah, uh, and also for my delay in introducing myself. The principal came himself? <laughs> also, yeah, he just walked in. I'm the director of Uber Academy. Oh no, Evie, stay there. You may call me Mr. Clavel. The director? And you came in person to help my daughter with her first day? Well, I am responsible for the entire academy, including any failures on its part. Wow, we're getting greeted personally by the director of the entire bloody school. So that's nice. Uh, so here at last are the enrollment documents that should have already been delivered to you. Look how cool our mum is. <laughs> mum's so cool. My goodness, you really needn't have. Since you've come all this way, can I at least offer you a cup of tea? Uh, no need to trouble yourself. Claire, I've got a thing or two to discuss with the director here. Oh, mum's just like, nah, <laughs> not taking it for an answer. Why don't you head back up to your room and finish getting ready for school? You'll need your bag and your hat as well. I do have that upstairs. Uh, now, Mr. Clavel, you must simply join me for a cuppa this way okay well, how can i refuse such a kind offer yes go ahead let me get my bag and my cute hat i only wish i could change these shorts that's my only <laughs> my only wish in this game it's shining that means select it oh should i spend a bit more time exploring come on down to every which way oh sandwiches i like sandwiches our subs are handmade by pros and perfect for picnics okay i don't think there's anything left here right Maybe we just grab our things and go. Da da da. Let's start our journey. Start it. Excited. Papa. Okay, cute. I don't know how our buns managed to fit inside that hat, <laughs> but it's cute. Okay, we're ready. What did our mum have to talk to the director about? Oh, just look at you all ready for your big first day yes the uniform of our storied academy suits you quite well indeed it's very practical oh gracious how very careless of me i had entirely forgotten that i've something else for you miss claire a most important thing but your living room is hardly the place for it would you care to follow me outside what is he doing they fold into your heat. No, the visual. The visual of that, DM. <laughs> I wonder what this important thing might be. Let's follow the director out and see, shall we? Oh, it is very Mediterranean, this whole place. Cute. Well, they detach in there in your bag. <laughs> That's possible. That's very possible. Can I take off the hat, by the way? I want to hide the hat. <laughs> Can I do that? Right then, dear Pokemon, time to come out of your Pokeballs. <gasps> I'm choosing my Pokemon right now and here in Norland right now. <laughs> here they are. I kind of already know what I want. And I think you can guess what I want. <laughs> we provide each student entering the academy a Pokemon of their own. I'll ask you to choose which among these three you'd like to have as your partner. Sprigatito, the grass cat Pokemon. Yote. Fuecoco, the fire croc Pokemon. Rar. And Quexley, the duckling Pokemon. So the director almost forgot to provide you the Pokemon. Kind of a key aspect of a Pokemon, Pokemon Academy is having a Pokemon. <laughs> Also, are they too dirty to open up inside? I feel like we have plenty of space inside as well. Only thing you get to pick to customize your character spends 50 hours with a bucket hell. <laughs> exactly. Why am I covering up the hairdo I so carefully selected? What is going on? Pomp. Nice pompadour. 
Nice. We could have chose the Pompadour hairstyle to match Quaxley. They're all very good company. Why, they usually refuse to even leave my side. <laughs> but they're coming up to me because they love me already. What's this? Hmm, so it turns out they're more interested in you, Miss Claire. How could they not be? <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, <laughs> Donald Duck, yeah. Donald Duck is definitely... Mm-hmm. The Pokemon I was meant to get. Yeah, that Pokemon. <laughs> Donald Duck, honestly, don't mind him. Don't like his evolutions. So we could keep Quaxley as Quaxley. But I, I don't really like Quaxley's evolutions. Honestly. I do wish I could stay to see which one you'll choose. What, he's leaving now? I must be off on my next home visit. How many accidents have happened? I'll be at... Oh, this is our rival. There's always a rival. I'll be at the house just over there. Take your time with your decision. Then come find me once your mind is made up. And then my rival will pick the one that is directly stronger whatever you call it than mine the the one of the real fue coco he's so cute <laughs> he's so cute i do like fue coco because he, yeah he's he is the like dirt dirt face <laughs> oh, if you excuse me until we next meet what a mannerly fellow that director of yours is i i know that the rival is looks like a rich house but I kind of like our house better. I feel like it's like Mediterranean cottage core. Right? Kind of cute. What a mannerly fellow that director of yours is. These three are all lovely, but you need to choose just one, right? Not an easy task. I already know what I'm choosing. <laughs> Why not take this opportunity to walk about with these little ones to get to know? Oh, I'll do that though. I'm sure they have lots to teach you. But before you go... I got you a little something to celebrate your big day. Why can't I have all three if they all love me? Take it with you if you're going out on your own. Thanks, Mum. You obtain the Rotom Phone. You put the Rotom Phone. Is that how you pronounce it? Rotom? Rotom Phone? In your bag's key items pocket. X, right? The latest model of smartphone, a Pokemon called Rotom, lives within it. It's an actual Pokemon smartphone. <laughs> and it can be used to run all sorts of handy apps. I, I don't know how I feel about technology Pokemon. You know, like robot Pokemon. Which is what we're about to get. The, our bicycle is a robot. But, you know, I just, it's a little weird. <laughs> it's a little weird. It's a brand new phone. According to the instructions, you can check the map app by pressing Y button. It'll keep you from getting lost, so take good care of your new gadget. Love a map. Now off you go, have fun. Bye, Mum. Bye, Mum, Mum. Oh, look at them. What's Fry Coco doing? Head to the house down the way. Can I. Wait, is the. Are the controls inverted? I gotta admit, I never give my Pokemon nicknames, but for the purpose of this playthrough, I'm going to. And I'll need your help naming my Pokemon. Inverted. Is, does that fix it? Is it because I've been playing with Wind Waker, which was inverted controls, that I'm now used to inverted? I don't know. Okay, that's better. Maybe it's because I've been playing Wind Waker. <laughs> you call one of them Tingle. Oh no. What would Tingle be of all of them? I can't wait for Girthy the Goose. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Actually kind of a good name. <laughs> Actually kind of a good name. <laughs> Gonna be really hard to explain to people, but yeah, kind of a good name. Look at them all. Follow me. What'd you find? What are they doing? They want to run through the grass. Oh, I see someone down there. Is this our rival? You know, I had pre-selected one. But I'm kind of... <laughs> I'm kind of torn now that I see them animated. No, I think I know what I want. Oh, no, it's not. Welcome. This is Cabo Poco. It's not much. Just a little pinch of a community, but it's home. Look at the way Fue Coco runs. He's <laughs> so cute. <laughs> oh, no. I originally, I was going to buy Scarlet because I have a friend who has Violet, but then I prefer Violet. I prefer the, the Pokemon from Violet. Oh, where'd they go? Oh my gosh. Uh, <laughs> cute. 
<laughs> oh wow model oh in the flowers oh you won <laughs> such a deuce are you gonna fire it ha wow nice job <laughs> nice job wow oh this is our rival wait how does she get the cool green bits? Not quite Miss Cleo's yet to make a choice, you see. Oh. Uh oh. I do wonder which of them she will choose as her Pokemon or whatever it's head. Oh, <laughs> I dropped it. Oh no. It's time. I need him. So here's the thing. I was 1000% gonna choose Sprigatito, but Fuecoco is kind of cute. <laughs> it's kind of cute. I could probably get one later. But look at him, look at his face. Buena, so we haven't met, have we? How could we, does she live at their house? I must say, I wasn't expecting to see you here quite so soon. Hang on, director, is it who I think it is? Yes, this is our academy's newest student, Miss Clea. She will be attending as of today. Check the evolutions. Yeah, that's the thing. The evolutions, I think, Sprigatito wins. You know? Fuecoco's really cute in Fuecoco. But... Does he continue to be cute when he evolves? Oh, this is our academy's newest student, Miss Clea. She will be attending as of today. I will. So you're the kid who moved in. Oh, we're new to town. Okay, that's why we don't know this person. Because this town is literally two houses. So if we didn't know each other, that would be a bit weird. <laughs> That'd be a little strange. I've been dying to find out more about you. I'm Nimona. Normally I live on the, in the school dorms. Oh, that makes sense too. It's a boarding school. But home is here. What do you say, new neighbor? Want to be friends? Well, I think we're supposed to be, you know, enemies. No. <laughs> yeah, I want to be friends. Love that enthusiasm. We're going to get along just fine. Miss Nimona is the president of our student council and a champion ranked trainer in her own right. Wow. Fue Coco becomes a crocodile. <laughs> yeah, I think Sprigatito is kind of cuter. It's like a, almost like a furry, but like in a cute way. <laughs> Do you explain that? <laughs> A cute one. Like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I absolutely love Pokemon battling. In fact, we should try battle right now, you and me. I mean, hold on a second, lady. Easy now. You two will be in the same class, so you'll have plenty of time to battle. Wait. I'm going to be in the same class as a champion level trainer? Is there no, like, you know, first grade kind of thing? So uh, and get to know one each blah, 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 and get to know one another better. Of course, we're going to be neighbors and classmates. Nice. We'll be able to battle all we want. <laughs> On that note, Miss Clear. Oh, I gotta choose. Yeah, I think it is Brigadito. Fue Coco is just so cute in Fue Coco form, though. <laughs> Have you decided which of these Pokemon will become your first partner? You know, I picked the basic B here. I'm going to pick the basic B Pokemon. Grass Cat. Spur. That's Sprigatito, a grass type Pokemon. It can use its plant powers to soak up whatever water you throw at it. Oh, it's telling me its strengths already. So it's, it's strong against water types, I guess. Would you like to go with our good grass with our good grass type Pokemon Sprigatito here yeah yeah I do yeah Spur. you're so cute you choose Sprigatito would you like to give Sprigatito a nickname yes what about like <laughs> what about like broccolini <laughs> oh clover it kind of has a clover on it <laughs> that's better than broccolini <laughs> Asparagus, <laughs> mint, <laughs> name all the green vegetables and herbs. 
<laughs> okay, I like clover. I do kind of, now that I've said it out loud, I kind of like broccolini. <laughs> I kind of like it. I know I asked you for names and then I've just gone, I like it. <laughs> I like it. It's like a cute little broccolini. Okay, broccolini. <laughs> Yay! Oh, it goes on my arm. It's kind of hovering off my arm, but it's on my arm. Oh! Also, it matches my hair. I just realized we choose green hair. Rigatito seems to have taken quite a liking to you, Miss Clea. Yay! Now watch as my rival has a fire type Pokemon. Or uses Fuecoco against me or something. This is your first Pokemon. Yes, please raise it with love and care. Of course. And of course, be sure to keep it tucked safely inside a Pokeball. Okay. But I want to keep it out at all times. <laughs> Clear, I can't actually believe... Uh, uh, wait, I can't believe you actually chose Sprigatito. Why? I mean, like, way to make the perfect choice for you. Is this person not our rival? <laughs> You two make such a good combo. She's way too nice. I'm skeptical of nice people. Is it because the director is there? Can I choose one of these Pokemon too? But you're already a student. You don't need a Pokemon. Oh, but did you not receive a Pokemon when you entered the academy, Miss Nimona? She's a champion trainer. Not back then. No, I had other Pokemon I was focused on raising at the time. But now I want to raise a new Pokemon alongside Clea while she raises her own new partner. Okay. Indeed, a rather splendid idea. She's going to pick Fue Coco. If you wish to raise one of these Pokemon on equal footing with Miss Clea here, I shall be more than happy to allow it. Yes! Quickly? Oh. Okay. Pump pump. <laughs> bop, bop. all right then now that we've chosen our pokemon we have to battle i'll be waiting for you down at the beach come join me when you're ready didn't the director just tell us not to battle <laughs> didn't he expressly say don't battle as you may have noticed miss nimona is a tad overly fond of pokemon battling oh poor fue coco i want him to come with us too but i do hope you'll join her for a battle it will help you get to know your pokemon as well Okay. Wait, Coco, I love you though. <laughs> I love you. Ah! I I know, I know, I should battle with her. I know, but also, wait, Coco. Oh wow, there's a whole arena out here. They truly are rich. They have their own arena. Sad wave. All right, I'll battle you. Anyone can be a Pokemon trainer as long as they have a Pokemon by their side. And it's our duty as trainers to help our Pokemon grow stronger through battle. So, you ready to battle me, Clea? Yeah. Perfecto. I'm so excited for this battle. I think I'll use... Mr. Mona? What? What, what, what? I trust you remember that Miss Clea is wholly inexperienced in Pokemon battling. Heh, whoops. Good call, Director. I was about to send out one of my usual partners right off the bat. I guess I'll take this chance to try out my new buddy instead. I guess you should. Come on, Claire, let's have a fruitful battle. Okay. I want a cool glove. She says up Mewtwo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Full, like, battle armor Mewtwo. You were challenged by Pokemon Trainer Nimona. Pokemon Trainer Nimona sent out quickly. Go, Broccolini! <laughs> Broccolini! Okay. I know this is your first Pokemon battle, so let's just have some fun. She seems like the overly competitive type, though. Level 5? Okay, let's battle. I think normal is... Oh. Wait, how much should I do and how much did it do? Scratch! Oh, okay. We're about even, but since I'm going first... Unless... unless... Oh, growl! I think I'm gonna win. My first battle. Oh, that slowed me down. Gotcha. That's why you do that kind of, <laughs> that kind of thing. But I win. Poor Quaxly. Now all I can think of is Power World. <laughs> now poor Pokemon dying. Level six. Nice. 
<laughs> wow, not bad, neighbor. <gasps> 300 monies? Wow. Look at you winning your first battle ever. You've got, an even, you've got even more potential than I thought. You're going to be a strong trainer for sure. But now I want to try a different strategy. Let's go again. Just one more battle. Oh, I was supposed to win. Miss Claire and Espresso are surely weary already from that last battle. Okay, she's getting wound in. What do you call it? <laughs> oh, sorry. I got caught up in all the excitement. I'm really sorry, Claire. Same to your Sprigatito, too. Eh, don't worry about it. All right, thanks, Claire. You two seem to be coming to be b b b b becoming fast friends. Though you've only just met. Can I count on you to take your new schoolmate under your wing, Miss Nimona? Wait, Coco is just there. <laughs> Usually they pick the one that's strongest against your Pokemon, right? But she didn't. She didn't do it. Okay. You bet, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That reminds me, since you're new to training Pokemon, there's an app you definitely need. <laughs> We're going to have so many apps. Can we get TikTok? Let me see it for a sec. Okay. Also, I think I've seen that we can get phone cases. So I'm kind of excited to customize my phone case. The Pokedex app was added to your Rotom phone. The Pokedex will automatically register any Pokemon you catch. Gotta catch them all, Pokemon! It's a must-have for Pokemon trainers. It's a super handy app. Our homeroom teacher, Mr. Jack, Mr. Jack, actually made it himself. Wait, what? Whoa. Back in my day, we used ordinary paper and handwritten notes to compile our Pokedexes. I feel like Pokedex has been around for a very long time. It's quite the age we live in now. Too true. Too true. Filling out a Pokedex by hand, I can't even imagine how much work that would take. Also, would he have to draw the Pokemon as he discovers them too? Oh, no, I suppose you can't. <laughs> you young people and your youth. Yet, no matter how much the times may change, the wonder of meeting new Pokemon never does. That's true. The, that is truly a timeless pleasure. Mm -hmm. And the more Pokemon that you encounter, the more you'll find yourself growing and changing. I hope you will both work hard toward the goal of completing your own Pokedexes. I do still have a few matters to discuss with your parents. Could I depend on you to see Miss Claire to the Academy? You would be doing me quite the favour. But what about the Pokemon that crashed into the sea? Of course, leave it to me. Then I leave her in your capable hands. Alright little one, it's time you and I were on our way. Way Coco, no! <laughs> I love you. <laughs> I love you. Maybe I ought to make a little more time to work on my Pokedex along with all my battling. All right. Speaking of Pokedex, is clear. You've probably never caught a wild Pokemon, right? Never. Never in my life. I'll show you the ropes before I take you to the academy. Come with me. Okay. I thought she was going to like do a switch and turn all full evil rival on us, but she did not. Look how cute. <gasps> okay, nine more volumes until your next reward. Okay, we get rewarded for catching many, many, many of them. That's cool. I assume we also catch many of them to in increase chance of shinies. Where'd she run to? This lady. Oh, there she is. Oh, it's my mum. How is our mum so cute? <laughs> She's so cute. Oh, clear. I hear that Nimona here will be taking you to school. Yes. That's right, man. Leave it to me. So you've already managed to make a friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I read about all the wonderful teachers you'll be having, you'll have looking after you at the school. Plus, so many handy facilities you can use as much as you like. Add in your new friend Nimona and it sounds like your school life is shaping up to be fantastic. Sure is. So she's got a ladle Pokeball. That's so cute. <laughs> Did they sell this apron? I need all the merch. Now you'll be staying in the school dorms. So I want you to promise me you'll eat proper meals. Here's a bit of spending money to start off with. Thanks, Mum. I also packed a lunch for your first day. You obtained sandwich from Mum. 
I'm guessing sandwiches are a big thing because we've already seen them on the TV as well. You put the sandwich from mom, mom in your bag's key items pocket. Sandwich. A dish made by sandwiching vegetables, meat, or other ingredients between two pieces of bread. It makes a fantastic meal when out on a picnic. Or maybe you better take these too. <gasps> potions. Thank you. You put the potions in your bag's medicines pocket. Use them on that precious little partner of yours should it get hurt in battle. Since it's a bit more open world, will we have to use potions more often, I wonder? Because there'll be less poker stop type things. Poker stops? What's the pokey pokey center? <laughs> the thing with the chances. Oh, the blissies. Oh man, I'm rusty on Pokemon. I know every day in your new life is going to be full of exciting experiences far from home. Just try and savor them all. The good times and the hard times too. Well, I hope there's no hard times. But if you ever want to come back home, you know your bed is always ready. Thanks, Mum. <laughs> Thanks, Mum. All right, then you had you two had better be off, I suppose. Take care on the way to school. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. <laughs> your mother's so nice, Clea. Oh, oh, but I was going to teach you how to catch Pokemon. Come on, vamos. Okay, she's very fast. Slow down a little. This way. 